Hey, what up? Sorry for the noise. I'm in the crypto mining office again, making a video here. Haven't done one for a while. This is Vsanity from the Cispros Mining Channel. Uh, back with another video regarding the infamous NVIDIA 170XX. Now, the reason why I'm making this video today is because um, I just got these bad boys in the mail today. Yeah, from uh, GPUmods.com, okay? This video is not sponsored by them. I'm just doing it, yeah, out of goodwill because, yeah, I saw they sell these um, blower shroud for the 170HX, so it's going to direct the airflow better because this thing gets really hot. It's like 75 degrees in this freaking room right now, yeah. So I ordered them like a month ago. It took like a month to arrive. So yeah, because of COVID and stuff. Yeah, but it's all good. They finally arrived. So yeah, check out, check them out. GPU, I'll, I'll throw the link in the description. So now I'm gonna try to install these and see if the heat will be better. Yeah, so right now I'm just using a very powerful fan. Uh, the, the Cooler Master 12038. Um, fan. It's very loud, very powerful, but it's just blowing air without any specific direction. It's like all over the place, right? The air. And then another fan sucking out the hot air. So hopefully with this, it will, you know, concentrate the airflow right through the, the, the it's got like a fun, like a tunnel, wind tunnel thing through the GPU. So I hope this will do a better job. Yeah. So you can see right now. Temperature is hot, 76 degrees. And it can only do 158 mega hash. If the temperature is lower, it could do 164. Yeah, if I could get it down to like 50, 60 something degrees, it will be able to do the full hash rate. Because this room is damn hot. It's like freaking 35 degrees right now. Yeah. So we'll be right back. After I install these bad boys onto the 170HX and we'll see if the temperature will be improved. Alright. A few moments later. Alright, we're back. So I installed the blower. It's pretty easy installation. Just remove that bracket there and then two screws. And then there's like some uh, double sided tape. The blower sticks onto the the housing and now what I did a little bit different is um, I reversed this fan now this fan is sucking the air out instead of blowing in because it's going this way now the air is going this way now now let's see let's see if there's any improvement let's see if there's any improvement okay all right let's check it out now in the in the previous video in my video before we did what, 158 point something mega hash at 76 degrees. So we did improve. Look, at least the temperature is not red anymore. And it's 159 mega hash, a little bit better. So this thing actually works. Now, we do have the power limited at 190. This is the control, control environment. So before, if I had this at no power limit, the GPU would just overheat. So now, let's remove the power limit, see what happens. See if the hash rate can go up without the temperatures going up too much. See now, it's 70 degrees, so huge improvement. As you guys see, we're not in the red zone anymore still hot but a lot better so this thing really does work yeah props to uh, gpumods.com I'll link in the description of how to if you own a 170hx and if you're not mining like industrially if you have like one or two of these this is definitely the way to go yeah way better than just regular fans blowing okay now temperature is going up. It's 70. It's not in the red again, but our hash rate has gone 
higher. We are 161.4 mega hash, which is not too bad. Okay, it's at 78 degrees now. Now, as soon as I remove the power limit, we have higher hash rate, but the temps are hotter. At 78, and we're using 249 watts. So for like another 50 watts, we got uh, about three, three something mega hash more. So you guys do the math. Do I just keep the power? Yeah, I think better to just keep the power at 198 and have 159 mega hash instead of like having it in the red. Maybe I'll run for a day like this. I don't know, see what happens. 250 watts, 79 degrees, 162 mega hash. While before it was 158 something mega hash at 76 degrees and 198 watts. That was before installing this. So I guess this is pretty much as hot as it will get. 79 degrees. All right, not bad. So this thing works. I conclude it works. So if we go back down to 190, we should see the temperatures drop. But the hash rate should also drop along. Let's do it one more time. Oh, it's at one. It's at 80 degrees now. So I think I better run, just run it at 198, 198 power limit, and have a cooler temperature instead. Yeah. Now you can see the temps dropping. Yep, temperature dropping, hash rate also dropping. And then the water should have 198. Yep. Yeah, and I still got a couple of these 170 HX. Just two right here, if you want. DM me on Instagram. They come with these Tesla plugs. I think they call it Tesla plugs. Yeah, official NVIDIA, man. Yep, seal, not open yet. All right. Let's go. Yep, temperature is going down, hash rate going down. All right, so this concludes our experiment. Uh, blower shroud built for the 170 HX, as well as the A100, or A1000, I think. Yeah, the CMP. It works for two models. So yeah, check out the link below. Thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe. Many people are not subscribed. Help me reach uh, monetization soon. Watch my videos. Give this video a thumbs up. Comment down below and I'll see you in the next video. Peace out. Keep mining.